back to another day in the boneyard. I uh, fucking fucked up some of the footage here, so we're gonna pick up where we left off. Oh yeah. I forgot, I fucking forgot to film all the stuff that happened in the cabin. Josh looked really freaked out at the seance. Yeah, he looked like he was keeping it together, but... I think we should have mentioned his sisters. That's why we came back up here. Yeah, but not to, like, have a seance. We really went too far. I would say that was a dick move for sure. Oh, what's this? Dun dun dun. This is creepy. Do this. Ooh. What? Whoa, is what this? Did you find? That's creepy. Holy cow. I better not tell her that. Uh, well, no, there's, there's really not much in here. Did you look everywhere? Uh, are we really going to take orders from a spirit but board? But it said the library. Ash, there's nothing here. Let's just go find Josh, okay? Hmm. Where am I going? Not that way. Oh, get out of my way. <laughs> All right. Oh, yeah. Of course. What was that? I don't know. We're going to find out. secret room back there with the button and the moving wall. It was just empty. Oh, what's this? Dun dun. Looks like it was written by Josh's mom. Yeah, she's really making an effort to set things right with some kind of tribe or something. Yeah, huh. the bad karma goes back. Yeah, no doubt. He only fucking tried to genocide them. Anyway, so let's see what's in here. We're not going out there yet. What? 
There was like this wanted poster, like full on Western style, you know? So? And Sam really thought there was someone following her around. So, so what you're saying, there's some criminal up on the mountain with <laughs> Maybe. Answering machine I found, and it, it, it was from this sergeant saying that there was this guy who just got out of prison and there was nothing he could do. What do you mean? He was saying it like, like a warning. I mean, maybe that's whoever was down in the basement before. What? <laughs> Under the floorboards in the library, the light. Well, there was that guy I told you. Whoa, about. Wait, 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 what guy? The guy who threatened the Washingtons. He said he wanted to take revenge by burning the whole place down. Chris, this is your what? Way to at her, you're fired. You hear that? Open it. That was Josh. Coming from the kitchen. Josh! Josh! Coming! Hold on! What? Fuck everyone dying on me here. Fucking bash it, man. Kick it, actually. Josh? Get up. Josh? Hey. Oh, fuck. There's just some dude in a mask. Not no fucking ghost. Huh. All right. This guy's office is getting fucking creepy too. What you gotta say, Doc? What's wrong with me now? I'm going to show you some uh, pictures of people that you have come to know. I like people. But maybe you don't like them as much as you pretend to. <laughs> well, this is an exercise in honesty. Tell me which person from each pair you like the most. Take your time. Of course they are. Yeah, she's a bit of a creepo. I don't like either one of those people. We'll take him this time. They're both fucking idiots. Actually, Chris is a bit of a fucking weirdo, too. She's dead now. Mike's alright. Oh, more people? I prefer Josh more than her. She's a bitch. Obviously. <laughs> oh. In this little game you're playing so diligently, who is it that you most dislike? I don't like her at all. A bit too bitchy for you. Yep. Just a little bit like maybe. Well again, I'm afraid we're out of time. Oh. Talk again. I don't think that was worth the hundred dollars an hour, Doc, but I guess that's gonna end this episode here.